it's Donna with Resale Tips and Tales, and I am bringing to you my favorite video of the week, my favorite eBay sales from last week. So I had a really good week last week, so I have some great things to share with you guys. It was a busy week, but a great week. So I love when I hear those cha-chings coming through on my app. Um, it just means I am selling more and more and more. So I want to share with you guys what I found. Um, I'm going to start with shoes today, because shoes are my favorite, but I sold a couple pairs uh, this last week. Um, the first ones that you see here, these are my favorite brand. These are Brooks, and this is a type called Cascadia. Um, and these are more of like a trail running type shoe. Um, these I bought for $8, so I spent a little bit more on these, but again, it's my favorite brand, and I know that they sell well. And these I sold for $28, so I made a decent profit on these. Uh, the next shoes here I have had for a very long time, <laughs> and they just caught my eye. I don't know why they've been sitting for so long, because I thought they were really neat. Um, I described them as like an Eskimo boot, because they have this faux fur <laughs> down the side of them. Um, but they're made by Naturalizers, so it's a really good brand as well. Um, I paid $6 for these, and I actually have had these since 2015, so a long time. Um, but I did sell them recently for $20, so I took a best offer on those, because I've had them for so long. Um, but who wouldn't want these boots? Anyway, uh, the next pair I just recently bought, these are Sperry Yellow Duck Boots. They're like a rain type galosh boot. Um, I paid $5.96 and I sold those for $25. So that was pretty good. And the front, the leather toe part was really beat up on them. So I was surprised they even got that much for them. Um, next, uh, I sold a bunch of bags last week, and these are a few that I sold. This one here is a Nine West Circle bag. It was really pretty, and I've had this one for a couple of years as well, um, and I've had a lot of watchers on it, so I decided to do um, the listing trick that I shared in one of my other videos to get rid of your old stale inventory. Originally, I paid $6.49 for this purse, and I sold it for $19.99. It was a full price offer, so I uh, can't beat that. And let's see, I bought that 2016, so I've had that for two years, <laughs> so I'll take it. Um, this next purse I just recently bought. This is a Rock Rebel black and has a lace over the front with like a red color behind it. Um, this caught my eye in the, the thrift store and I didn't really know what the brand was. Um, but I paid $6.98 for it and I sold it for $24.99. And this is going overseas somewhere. I can't remember where I shipped it to, um, but it did go somewhere overseas. So hopefully they like it. Um, this next bag I also bought recently. It's a Lauren, Ralph Lauren with a leopard print. Sit down, sweetie. Say hi, Kyla. Um, and this bag I bought on sale for only a dollar, so that was a really good find. Oh, and yeah. I sold it for $19 on a best offer. Um, let's see, this one I also bought recently. This is Stone Mountain. I've bought these in the past, and they really they vary in terms of whether they sell or not and which ones sell. But this one's an all leather one, and those tend to sell better. Um, this is... I paid $2 at one of my local church thrift stores, and I sold it for $19. So that must have been the going price this week for purses. Okay, moving on to some clothing items. You want to say hi? Okay, Kyla's a little tired today, but we're going to get through this, right? All right, go play. No. no All right. right. Um, this here I bought for... Um, this is an Express Red Rain Jacket. Um, it was really pretty. It jumped out to me on the racks. And it was only $2.50. Can't beat that. And I sold this for $29.99. So I've been doing really well with jackets and fleeces lately. Um, this next one is a Lauren Ralph Lauren Active. It's blue and black colors, so that's what caught my eye. And, of course, it was Ralph Lauren brand, which I love if you've been watching my videos. Um, this I only paid $2 for, and I sold it for $22.99. So, again, another great, uh, it's like an active wear type shirt. All right, this next one is another fleece. It's a Mountain Horse green zip-up fleece. Now, I paid a little more than I had wanted to for this. Um, I paid $7.00. And 99 cents for this and I sold it for $18 so I didn't make a huge profit on it but I at least made my money back on it go play Kyla um, this is a popular brand but I've learned that maybe the shirts don't sell as well but this one did this is a sorry <laughs> this is a North Face black long sleeve women's shirt it's a very tight like a compression type shirt um but i only paid three dollars and 74 cents for it and i was able to get 19.99 for it so it was a full price they didn't even do a best offer so 
Um, this next item is another Ralph Lauren. Um, this is a white cardigan. I just listed this and the same day I sold it. So maybe I had it priced too low, but it was a quick flip, so you can't beat that. I only paid $3.25 for it, and I sold it for $22.50. So it was totally worth it. Um, this next item I have had for a while in my inventory as well. I thought it was beautiful. I almost put it in my own closet <laughs> because I loved it. Um, this is by Forever 21. The label said, I love H81. So I don't know if that's an off-brand from them, um, but on the smaller tags, it said Forever 21. Um, this is like an Aztec. It's a tunic sweater that wraps around with a belt. Um, like I said, it's really pretty. $2.75 is what I paid for it at a local Goodwill, um, and I've had it for a while. I sold it for $17.75 on a best offer, but I've had it since 2016, so two years, so that was totally worth the best offer. Um, again, another Ralph Lauren. This I bought a few weeks ago. It's a beige fleece zip front. Like I said, get out there and look at those fleeces. Um, I paid $5.99 for this, and I sold it for $34.99, so full price. So it was just a hot week for fleeces. <laughs> No pun intended. Um, and it's interesting we're going into the springtime, so I don't know why they sold so well this week. Um, this pair of shorts I bought a few weeks ago, hoping that they would fit me, and they didn't. <laughs> These are Burton brand. It's a green floral print, but they were new with tags. I had never heard of this brand, except for maybe snowboarding. <laughs> so I'm not sure if they have a line or if it's a different company. Um, but either way, I paid $6 for these, and I sold them for $34.99. So that was really nice. All right, this is another item you may have noticed from a recent video. This is a Lululemon. This is an athletic wear. All of you women, I'm sure, have heard of this before. Um, I only paid $3.37 for these pants, and I sold them for $30. That was an offer, but I had them listed for about two weeks. Okay, stand up, sweetheart. Um, so I went ahead and accepted that, and the comps were right about that price, so I was really happy about that price. Okay, this next item here is a Banana Republic sweater, and the reason I bought it was because of the design, the v-neck, but it also is a wool cashmere mix, so I knew that that would sell well. Um, cashmere has been selling really well for me this year. Um, I only paid a dollar for this at a small church thrift store, and I turned it around for $17, so that was great money in my pocket. And then this last item... This was my big sale for the week and I was super excited about it. Um, this is the RLX green fleece type jacket that I bought a few weeks ago. Um, I only paid $3.98 for this and I sold it for $59.99. Now this is an interesting company that bought this item. I've sold a few things in the past from this company. Um, it's called Shop Airline, I believe, but they buy for people in Japan and then they ship it. So I'm actually shipping it to California and then they take care of it from there. So I don't know all the details, um, but trust the company. I haven't had any issues, so knock on wood. <laughs> um, but I have sold some really high dollar items for, from this company. Um, so keep a lookout for them. Um, other than that, like I said, it was a great week, so hopefully you guys had great sales as well. Um, comment below with what your best sale was last week, or if you have any questions that you saw in the video. Make sure that you like and comment the video so you can see all of my future videos as well. All right, until next week, guys. Happy thrifting.